UEFA Champions League final decode. This is a super tough game to call as it's so double coded, but I like Manchester City to win the Champions League. I will not be betting much on this game, but if Man City do win it, it's all about the 2 1 6. And if they don't win, the below information is still mind blowing. So 2 1 6. This is off the charts, guys. Pep Guardiola was hired to become Manchester City head coach in 2016, like 2 1 6. Kobe retired in 2016. I've shown in previous videos that the FA Cup final was connected to him, the Europa League final was connected to him, and the Champions League final will be connected to him. Pep Guardiola can get his 216th win as Manchester City head coach on a day leaving 216 days left in the year. Pep's first full-time management role in football was coaching Barcelona B. It was hired on the 21st of June, 2007, like 2-1-6. The final is going to be in Portugal, and Portugal's president was elected in 2016, like 2 one 6 6 times 6 times 6 equals 216. Kobe got his highest scoring game in his 666th game. And let's not forget that last year's Champions League final was played on his birthday, August the 23rd, 2020. Frank Vogel, the head coach of the Los Angeles Lakers, was born on the 21st of June, like 216. LeBron James was born in Cleveland, and Cleveland's dialing code is 216. Black Panther, starring Chadwick Boseman, was released in theatres in the US on February the 16th. Like 216. Chadwick Boseman was heavily connected to the Los Angeles Dodgers winning the World Series. Just watch his movie, 42, which was in tribute to Jackie Robinson, who played for the Dodgers. When you type in 216, it gets you 87. Number of the Beast equals 87. Guardiola can stay on 87 all time losses. Also, I like that Guardiola can stay on 36 draws as Man City coach because Pep ended his spells with Barcelona B, Barcelona and Bayern Munich on the 30th of June. Like 36. 666 is a 36 triangular number and obviously 666 is connected to 216. The game is 131 days after Pep's recent birthday. Championship equals 131. I think he'll be lifting another championship. 56, a huge number. I expect Guardiola to end the season with three trophies for Manchester City. Guardiola equals 56. Three equals 56. Funny that Chelsea is sponsored by three and Pep's upcoming birthday is in 33 weeks and three days. And Guardiola can also win his third Champions League. He won it in 2009 and 2011. He can win his third in 2021. Manchester equals 56. LeBron looking to go five and six in NBA Finals. NBA Finals begin on 56 date numerology. And game one of the NBA Finals, guys, will be LeBron's 56 appearance in an NBA Final if he plays in it. Pep can stay on 113 career losses. Kobe Bryant equals 113. It will be Tuchel's 30th game as head coach of Chelsea and 113 is the 30th grand. Pep can pick up 114 draw though and stay on 42 losses and LeBron James equals 114 and 42. Lakers equals 42. So I really do like Pep to stay on 42 losses. He was born on 18th of January, like 18-1, like 181, and 181 is the 42nd prime. Another reason for him to stay on 42 losses. There is exactly four months and 20 days between the coach's most recent birthdays, like 42. Also, the game is 21 weeks and three days after LeBron's 36th birthday, 36. But 213 is LA's dialing code. I know that as I lived there. 66. This is the 66th edition of the Champions League. Tuchel currently has six draws and five losses as head coach of Chelsea. And with a loss, that will advance to six and six. 
Number of the Beast equals 66. Chelsea Football Club equals 66. Estadio de Drago equals 66. The stadium where it's taking place, the Champions League final. LeBron James equals 66. LeBron equals 66. Lakers equals 66. I do believe LeBron James will end his career 6-6 six and six in NBA Finals. 75. Kobe equals 75. That could be good for Chelsea because if Tuchel and Chelsea draw, he will have seven draws and five losses, like 75. And the Champions League final is being played on 75 day numerology. But I just think the 75 is just a tribute to Kobe. 18. Tuchel can stay on 18 wins as Chelsea coach. Lakers looking for their 18th championship. Guardiola was born on the 18th day of the year. And just know that LeBron James' highest scoring game in the NBA is 61 points. The 18th prime. 96. Big Freemason number. So Shell can stay on 96 all-time draws. The 2020 Champions League was nine months and six days before the upcoming final. He was coaching PSG against Bayern Munich and he lost in that game. And I think he's going to lose again. Lakers equals 96 and Kobe was drafted in 1996. 163, huge number. The final takes place 16 months and three days after the death of Kobe. The game is 163 days after the Pope's most recent birthday. Manchester City equals 163. 163 is the 38th prime and Portugal equals 38, where the final takes place. So they last played each other, guys, on May the 8th, like 5-8. And Los Angeles Lakers equals 58. Kobe Bryant equals 58. Championship equals 58. Chelsea won that game 2-1. And the Champions League final is 21 days after that game. Kobe equals 21. I would not be shocked, guys, if Man City do win this 2-1. But I'm not going to place a bet on it. Guardiola was hired by both Barcelona and Manchester City on July the 1st. Like 7-1. And Estadio de Vago equals 71, where I think Guardiola is going to be picking up another Champions League trophy. It's first with Manchester City. Side note, I don't believe Aguero is going to score. And I hope he doesn't score because Sergio Aguero equals 184. And he is Man City's leading all-time scorer with 184 goals. So if he stays on this, because he's leaving, this will be his last game. His name equals 184, and he's their all-time leading goal scorer with 184 goals. What an absolute ritual. His whole connection as well with Messi and Maradona, there's something not right with it. Portugal president's birthday is in six months and 13 days, like 613. And 613 is the 112th prime. And Tuchel can pick up his 112th career loss. I was a little bit worried because he can stay on 111 career losses. We saw how that penalty shootout in the Europa League finished 11-10, like 1-1-1. Hawking Mario Bergoglio equals 1-1-1, full name of the Pope. So that's a concern, but I think this is even better. The anniversary of coronavirus being declared a pandemic was 11 weeks and two days ago, like 1-1-2. I also like that Man City were founded in 1880 and Bavarian Illuminati equals 188, greatest of all time equals 188. And Guardiola, if he wins this, arguably is the greatest of all time. Also, LeBron, if he goes five and six, he could be regarded as the greatest of all time. The GOAT, these GOAT rituals like Brady. So, Kobe, look at this. For anyone who says that Kobe is not connected to UEFA Champions League or UEFA, Kobe equals 33, 15, 75, and 21. UEFA equals 33, 15, 75, and 21. So again, Kobe has these numbers, but it's not just about Kobe, it's the numbers associated with Kobe. This is insane, guys. There's a, there's a lot of people who think Chelsea are going to win this, which I get. I do get it. That's why I'm not going to put a ton of money on Man City. A lot of people think it's going to go to penalties. But when was the last time a Europa League final and a Champions League final both ended in penalty shootouts? I can't remember one in my lifetime. May have happened. I can't think of one. I also don't like both Manchester teams to lose. I don't like both underdogs to win. 
But the main reason I'm going for Manchester City to win the Champions League is these two one sixes. And again, guys, if Chelsea somehow win this, there's no denying these connections. Like, why? Why did Pep end his spells with Barcelona B, Barcelona and Bayern Munich on the 30th of June? Why? What are the chances? Hey, what are the chances? And all these two one sixes. There's a reason why Guardiola was hired by Man City in 2016 for the 216. There's a reason why Kobe retired in 2016. Why did he retire when he was still dominating? And in Kobe's last season, he played 66 games for the Lakers. Really? So there we have it, guys. Good luck if you've got Chelsea. Again, I won't be majorly shocked if they win. But I'm going Man City, and I'm, I'm going to go on them to win in 90 minutes. I'm not going to get on them to lift the trophy. I'm going to get on them to win inside 90 minutes because that's the only way this 2 one six plays. If it's a draw, it's going to stay on 215 wins as Man City coach. Manchester City equals 215, but I don't think that's significant. The Super Bowl was satanic. I think the Champions League final will be satanic. And Man City, Guardiola have all of the satanic numbers connected to them to be this year's Champions League winners.